How many times have you been super excited to watch a movie? You wait a year, there's billboards everywhere, there's advertisements all over the place, trailers galore. You spend three hours waiting in line, you throw your $10, and it absolutely sucks. But I mean, this is a $200 million Hollywood production. We think the real reason why it's poor is because of its story. We really want to share with you our philosophy on filmmaking. It's, it's so much more than the gear. It's so much more than creating amazing imagery. Well, it is those things. It's the bigger picture. Color is not just about making a clip look cool. It's about making an emotional impact, about pulling you into the story, and it's about making an informed decision about how you want people to perceive the piece you produced. What we really want to share with you is why and how all of these things fit together. We're going to bring our best work and we're going to tear it apart. We're going to really show you why we chose that lens, why we did this camera move, and how they all fit together, and then why we colored it in the way we did. It's an opportunity to really understand what integrity means in calling yourself an artist. There is this misconception in our industry that it takes forever, that it takes years to become a better shooter, better editor, better storyteller. In reality, it doesn't have to take years. All it is is you just have to start seeing things in a different way. I'm excited to be a part of the Still Motion Workshops in Australia. It's the kick in the butt that our industry really needs, but also it's awesome to be a part of it as an Aussie to make sure that what these guys are teaching us and what we're going to learn at the workshops is relevant to our Australian industry and that we can take what we learn and we can use it right away to change what we do. The experience for us was truly life-changing. I'm really, really excited to see where our films are going to go and where they can go. We've never seen a studio like Still Motion come to our country before. We've never seen a workshop like these guys are going to put on. You really want to question why you're doing what you're doing. And you really want to realize that if you don't force yourself, this is a very active process, it's so easy to slip into routine. What are the things that you don't see? At every single wedding you shoot, what are the things that you walked by that could have been amazing to shoot? The key is to think about it, right? To actively think about it. And more than ever, today you, can, you actually have the opportunity to have the most low-cost tools in the industry that can produce production value that is comparable to what you see in movies. You have low-cost steady cams, you have 35 adapters, you can have workstations that are affordable enough to, for you to do color correction and grading that is comparable to what you see in movies. But the biggest tool is none of that, and the biggest tool is right here. And that's to actually understand the language of film. The difference between the best and the worst in the industry is as simple as a light switch. It really can mean just moving to the side subtly, seeing the light in a different way putting this shot before that shot instead of after. You know, for the most part, you already have the gear you need. You already have all the tools you need to create really inspiring work. It's just about developing a deeper understanding of the language of film and trying to see things in a completely different way.